Greetings, it is ICCQ. Uh, we're working with uh, kind of some transmissions or activations or just energy. <laughs> so we'll see what you think. So please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for further transmissions or other states of consciousness that I'm um, playing in. So, uh, so today it's all about light codes. It's an offering of remembrance. So we're going to start right now. <laughs> Heal unto thee a remembrance of awakening to this vessel. Encaptured into a state of holding in an energetic stream of you and me. Upon arrival, we are met with newfound kindlings on the flip side of the Westings. There is still a sense of being in both places at the same time. For a little while, the integration of self learns how best to be here now. Familial tribe here orients the newly arrived by offerings of the roadmap ahead. Fresh from the Westings, you will have a heightened sense of awareness. What you will be experiencing is so extraordinarily different surreal. First awareness is, what am I? <laughs> what am I? Second awareness is, what am I? Third awareness is, who was I before this? Heal unto thee a kindling of shreds of initial origin known with each inhale. Each exhale now releases the initial cause of the vessel's understanding. Like a chalkboard in a classroom, a complete lesson is written with full details. Erased by the exhale, origins ancient wisdom is lost. Here at a new point of origins, spins of this rock, a new point enters through the crown. From the crown, the highest physical point of body, crown will open for some. Liquid streams of thread, Golden in color, pour in now. To the heart of the being, rings of colors of blue and green and luminescent pinks weave in, now spiraling and vibrating in toroidal waves upon waves, enlivening the codes within the body. Sparking, activating, arousing, cheering, encouraging, energizing, enlivening, exalting, exciting, firing, spurring, stimulating, stirring, vitalizing all systems of the vessel now. All systems of the physical body have been upgraded in the remembrance of the timelessness of now. Oh, the light pouring in. New awareness is, I know where I came from. I remember it still. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know. I did that back in um, 2018, and I was doing podcast, and there wasn't much traction with it. But I have all the material, you know. So, um, so sometimes when we start working with written material, um, or some of these light codes, or these activations, or transmissions, um, I think it's really all about kind of my soul's messages, my akashic records. Uh, my body messages, the galactics, or any other states of consciousness. Consciousness. It could be source or God or whatever name that it resonates for you. You know, you get to choose. What does this really mean? So these light codes are really um, interesting and fascinating. And the more that we kind of just like go, wow, that was that's pretty groovy, right? Yeah, it's like pretty amazing. So all of this states of consciousness that I reside in and. I continue to write, 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 and then I listen uh, to that still small voice here on the right side. I start getting that guidance, and I'm always available to take a moment to pause, and then like, should I should I actually listen to that, or can I put it on pause? Um, and so it just really depends, you know, what's happening with you in your field. And so what I think what's really happening is with this uh, beautiful piece with these light codes, is that um, like new new beings have come onto the planet, right? And they don't really know who they are, or what they're doing, or where they come from, but they just start kind of leaning into a better experience 
for, you know, it takes a little bit of while to acclimate. And I think for each one of us, we're all acclimating differently, right? You know, so we come in and we do the best we can. And sometimes we make some boo-boos and then we just learn those are lessons. We start learning more. So if you're coming, you know, boots on the ground and maybe a person doesn't really know exactly why their purpose was here or what was the purpose, but we start acknowledging the beautiful breath of life of every being on this planet every being of this on this planet is really engaging with life in a, a beautiful rich and amazing way so i really share i love sharing these um pieces this was a short one um and again that was back in casa Grande when i first got here so i was in houston then i went to vegas for three months and then i ended up at casa Grande, and now i'm in sunny scottsdale for five years so i'm kind of like this little traveler you know i'm like a traveler i'm like well so what's next you know what else do i need to know what else do i need to experience um and i really find the energy up here um regarding light codes is that the energy is it's like pure energy here it's like freaking energy is just always humming and so some people say here in in arizona it's kind of a place of healing and and i get that you know i, I think i feel better i think i feel lighter in my body i feel more joyful more you know kind of situated i <laughs> kind of situated but I really um, embrace all the experiences that I've had up here in Arizona. And we'll see what's going to happen next. I don't know. Maybe I'll be here forever or maybe I'll just be floating around, you know. Like <laughs> so, Anyway, so thank you for, um, if you want to go into my YouTube channel, subscribe. You can um, do, uh, have a comment or a like or whatever you want to do. I love sharing at this material with, with all this material and all the material that I'm working with, I'm actually putting it underneath um, the description on YouTube. So all of this stuff is so freaking fun. I am absolutely enjoy, um, I don't know, just being, you know, just being in a state of, you know, here I am. Here I am, you know, so, so we'll see you soon <laughs> and namaste. <laughs>